A police officer whose past actions have come under question several times before is charged with beating a teen handcuffed in the back of his patrol car. Today, the state attorney's office released a video that they plan on using as evidence in the case against him. Joy is here now. Joy, you've been going through the videos. Mary Kent, the videos and pictures released, they paint a really vivid picture of an officer the state says is guilty of overstepping his authority when dealing with a suspect. <coughs> What's your name? Elias. Elias? Yes, sir. How old are you, buddy? So, are you, sir, 17. Okay. In this police interview, you can see a weeping Elias Campos. The 17-year-old's face is scarred, a bloody chin and lip, a cut near his eye, even blood in the back seat of a cop's car. Campos told investigators these injuries were inflicted by Officer Tim James, who himself was later arrested and charged with beating up the teen while that teen was handcuffed in the back of Officer James' patrol car. He just severely fist fighting me right there, and I'm like this. Ah, get off, get off. He's severely beating me up, and I'm trying to kick it. Oh, you want a kick? You want a kick? Like, I'm telling you, if you have cameras, I don't have to lie. You don't need to. Do you to get lie. out of the car at some point? I couldn't. At all? Do you ever get out of the car? I, how? Did they take you out of the car? Anything? Yeah, to stomp on my face. When was Officer that? James says Campos spit on him before the confrontation. The surveillance video of the incident shows Officer James getting out of his car and walking to the back passenger side. You can see a scuffle happening inside before the officer picks the handcuffed suspect up and slams him to the ground. During his police interview, Campos says he's afraid of what'll happen next. Well, I'm afraid of my life. Okay. Of my life. What happened if that man gets arrested after this All case? Right, listen to me. All right. He, he, he swear to God he's gonna kill me. Now, another interview released today was with Sergeant Howell, who was there at the scene that night. The sergeant describes how Officer James complained that the 17-year-old spit on him. The sergeant also describes how Officer James hit the teen numerous times, while the teen's brother was also in the backseat of the car, yelling for the officer to stop. Kent?